friends, today we are going to be making our sheep and our cow. So make sure you take out your wool, the fur on the sheep, and the clothespins. There should be four in the bag. And then I have our my black paint, and I'm going to get a Q-tip to paint. Or you can use your brush and then wash it later, okay? So make sure to cut out your sheep and your cow around the black line on the outside, okay? So make sure you have your big thumb into the little hole and your other fingers on the big holes so you guys can cut better. And then there's my sheep. I already cut it out. So put my garbage in the pile and I finished cutting my cow. Make sure you went around the air and don't cut it off, okay? Now that you're done with cutting, you're going to get your black paint. And did you know that there are some black sheep too? Well, I'm going to put some, um, I'm going to draw some big spots, black spots on my cow. Because these are called uh, hosting cows. I think they're called hosting cows. The brown cows are called Jer Jersey cows. And the hosting cows are the dairy cows. You know why dairies have a lot of cows? The black and white kind? Because these kind, they make the most milk. Did you know that a cow can make like eight gallons of milk, eight to ten gallons of milk every day? Like the big jugs that you guys, mommy and daddy, buys from the grocery store. So I'm going to let that cow dry, um, dry up. Okay. There's her black eyes. And these are her nostrils. So I'm going to let that dry up. Oh, you know what? See if you can make the your... Hosting cow, stand up, making a 3D. Cows, they love eating grass and um, silage, like pickle grass. There it is. Mm. So cows, farmers grow cows so we can get milk. And with milk, we can make so much food with milk. Did you know that? We can make cheese, yogurt. Ooh, my favorite ice cream, too. And here is my sheep. Sheep, I'm going to need my glue. You know, I've already put glue on there. And then I'm going to put the um, the cotton on there. To make it look like he grew a whole bunch of wool. And so what happens is um, the wool, when it grows very long, it's usually in the springtime, after the winter, the farmers will have special people come in, shear off their wool. And then they'll take it to a factory and make it into sweaters and many nice things. Wool. Wool is what we call the soft, curly hair of sheep and some other animals like goats and llamas. This hair can be made into yarn and used to knit wool sweaters and other warm clothing. This farmer is shearing the hair off one of her sheep so it can be used to make wool. The sweater she is wearing is made out of wool, which originally came from this very same sheep. So can you tell me on Learning Ginny, why does farmers raise cows and sheep? Can you tell me on Learning Ginny? I'll see you. Can't wait to hear from you. Goodbye.